Hi everyone, this is Dr. Kim, America's Holistic Foot Doctor. In this video, you'll be my patient who suffered from COVID-19 and had COVID-19 toes with a terrible infection. Then the nails started growing extremely thick and deformed. Let's see how I can make her nails look great again. Okay, we have Joanna here. Hi, Joanna. Hello. How are you doing? Alright. Okay. She's a beautiful girl, but got a nail like this one. They don't kind of match. So we're going to try to match it today, okay? Okay. Yeah. So you had a little story to tell me. So tell me what, what's happened here with this with these nails. You're only 19, right? Only 19. You shouldn't have these kind of nails with a beautiful face like this, huh? <laughs> so what, what's happened? So about a year ago, uh, I got COVID. Mm -hmm. And uh, I recovered successfully, but about... I don't know, two weeks after, uh, I started noticing a uh, sense of pain and swelling in my uh, nail beds on my big toes. Mm -hmm. um, so as uh, time went on, my nail beds started uh, bleeding and there were um, examples of uh, pus coming out of, oh. my, uh, of my toes as well. And it was mm -hmm. just kind of uh, constant. So, um, my grandmother uh, used to uh, come here, and my uh, mom had heard some of the home remedies mm -hmm. that were uh, talked about here. So, we soaked my feet in, um, in a, a bath, uh, and the, um, the pus and blood uh, came out pretty well. How long did that last, the pus coming out? coming out probably lasted about six months. Oh, six months? Something something like that. Uh, it was definitely more than two or three months. Um, really? Yeah. And then how about the redness? Uh, the redness lasted for longer than the pus did. Uh, it's still kind of um, red-purple uh, now. Um, was there a lot of pain? Yes. Really? There was, and you sorry. couldn't move your toes, huh? Wow. And then your, your doctors didn't want to see you, or what, what happened? So, um, it was in the time of COVID. Yeah, COVID, so they, you couldn't go see them? Couldn't see them, and then when we finally were able to see them, it was already mostly passed, and actually it grossed the doctor out. Really? <laughs> it was her, uh, her pediatrician, and mm. um, so she said, um, she took pictures of it, but... Mm -hmm. um, we'll see the foot doctor, right? Yeah, she just said, just go see the foot doctor. Yeah, they'll, they'll, they deal with the gross stuff. Go, <laughs> go see the foot doctors. Wow, it's amazing, huh? Yeah. But before this, your nail was normal. Yes, she had beautiful nails. Yeah, yeah. All of her nails are, you know, she had beautiful fingernails and toenails. Yeah, I'll show you some pictures that she showed me. It was amazing. The toe was red, it was pus draining, and it, it was terrible, huh? Yeah. Wow. COVID. Yeah. yeah, that's amazing how. So now the nail is really thick right now. So I don't want to cut you or hurt you. So I'm going to grind it down a little bit first okay. and then see how much we can get all this stuff out of there. Okay. okay. So let's do that. You're going to feel a little bit of uh, mist coming. You know? Oh, did you want to show the picture of the, of the COVID toes? Yeah, show, show, show the COVID toes. Uh, here the... Go and make it a little bit bigger. Yeah. Look at that one. That was red and it was... Show, show me the one with the pus coming out. That pus was mm. uh, this one. Yeah, look at, look at these. Red and swollen and pussy, huh? And it was draining for months? Yeah. Months. Wow. That's amazing. And all that pain, were you able to do anything? Um, with toes like that? Or did you just stay home? Yeah, I mean, she went to school, you know, and, um, and... You just finished school though, right? You just finished your high school? High school, and then college started. Uh-huh. Uh, were you able to go to college? Yeah. Oh, you did? With the, with the Kobe toes? Yeah. Wow. Uh huh. Paralyzed and I just went to school with the with the slides and socks. Oh really? Mm -hmm. Wow. 
noticed. Nobody noticed, right? Nobody noticed. <laughs> You're such a trooper. Wow. So the whole whole thing took like like six months? Yes, yes. Wow. But all that draining, nobody put you on a antibiotic? No, no. Wow. That's, that's amazing. I'm going to make your nail look very nice today, okay? Thank you. I can see that. Yeah. And then I'm going to send the sample to see if, if it's fungus or anything else, mm -hmm. okay? Wow. Yeah, we were wondering if there's going to be able to come back. Um, yes, well, we have to see. Well, we may have to do laser too because if it's really bad and you're so young, I think you would do really well with uh, laser. Okay. Not everybody responds to laser, but a lot of younger people do very well with laser. Have a brand new nail coming out. So, but we we'll first need to diagnose if you have fungus or not, okay. and then we can decide what to do from there. Okay. And then um, we'll talk about your diet and you have to help uh, your stomach. To improve your immune system which will help um... hi it's me again hope you've been enjoying this video so far if you have leave the word COVID nails in the comments below and don't forget to hit that subscribe button your fungus problem you know see nails already looking pretty good yeah yeah it's back to uh... <laughs> Uh, a year ago. Yeah. Uh, you've been through a lot. How, how long were you sick with the COVID? COVID only a couple weeks? Uh, about two weeks. Yeah, but this whole thing just continues. Yeah. Wow. I've seen pictures of COVID, but I've never, I mean, the COVID toes uh -huh. in our in our medical association journals and things, but I, I've never really seen it in person. Uh -huh. So thank you for bringing your toes. <laughs> we'll just be so happy if we can get a good story. Yeah. <laughs> like you said, she's too young and beautiful to... I know. This is crazy. This is cramping your style. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I'm going to do more on that side, okay? I'm just going to get rid of this thick nail here. First. Is that hurting or are you okay? Um, it doesn't look like it. Oh, okay. It looks pretty good. So, but it remains to be seen. But okay. you know, young people they heal so quickly. You know. Yeah. So that's a that's a good thing about you is whatever we do, it's gonna help you. Yeah. When you're a little bit older, nothing works sometimes. You know. Yeah. yeah. But I hope the the nail bed is not damaged. If the nail bed damaged, then the nail won't grow normal. So that's why we need to hurry up and work on it. Yeah. Where's the scenario if the nail bed is damaged and doesn't go back? What would you do? Uh, we don't have to do anything okay. unless it bothers you. But the way it looks right now, the your base of the nail looks pretty good actually. Okay. So I think you may have a beautiful nail grow again. Oh, that's great. Yeah, so we we hope so. Yeah. But so far your all the way at the base of the nail is pretty clean. Mm -hmm. So it's very hopeful. Okay. Yeah. So you're in college now, huh? Yes. Yeah. And then how do you deal with not, not being able to wear sandals? Were you wearing sandals? Uh, so, uh, I, I don't wear um, open-toe sandals anymore. I usually just wear a heel-toe sandal. Yeah. And then I don't wear a lot of uh, closed-toe shoes, but the sneakers that are more give around the uh, area. It's just kind of tough to do with them in front of all the kimono. Uh -huh. And it's pretty hot over there. So oh, I see. It would be nice if we could uh, have her being able to wear a regular sandals, huh? Sandal, yeah. It's coming. <laughs> That's good. It's coming soon. 
Gonna make it look nice. Yeah. I'll send all these samples to the laboratory and see okay. what they find, and then we keep working on the nails, mm -hmm. and then uh, make sure that the, all the new nails are coming and look nice, you know? Okay. That's what we'll be doing. Is that hurting? Uh, a little bit. A little bit, huh? You got a lot built up underneath it here. Mm -hmm. But the base, see the base here looks pretty clean. So I think uh, I'm hopeful. You built up a lot underneath here. This must have been painful, actually. Yeah. You got a lot of stuff underneath here. So you can really start soaking now and all this stuff underneath here will come out okay. when you soak it rather than me digging and giving yeah. you pain. I'm going to do some here, but I think when you soak it, all this stuff will come out. This one. Okay. And same thing here. There's a lot in here. Mm -hmm. I'll do some, but I think it's easier if you soak it in Epsom soap, a lot of this stuff will come out. Yeah. Yeah. So now the salt will get into this area because you had that other nail sitting in there, yeah. so it wouldn't wouldn't let all this the salt get to it. But now I think I think it would. How does the Epsom salt um, work with that? Um, it's it's a uh, you know salt kills everything, uh -huh. so it's the strongest antiseptic antibiotic. Uh -huh. So that's good for that. Also, it has a, a drawing property, so it, mm -hmm. it redraws all kinds of things out of the area. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it's it's got a it's called magnesium sulfate, mm -hmm. so it's got the uh, you know killing property, and then it it draws fluid out of the area. It so definitely, when uh, she was soaking, you know, you could see all the stuff coming out. Coming out, yeah, out. yeah, it's it's like really really good. So I have a few videos that I made about Epsom salt, you should watch that on my YouTube channel. So your toenail will be a YouTube star soon too. <laughs> I'm sure it's gonna get millions of views. <laughs> and we share the loyalty, okay? <laughs> we're just happy to get some resolution. Okay? Yeah. What do you think? It looks better, huh? Yeah, but it's a process. I don't want to do too much because it may hurt you. Yeah. So we did. We can do this much today, and then we we'll do some more next time, and then we get it down further and further, and that's how we do it. Okay. I'm not sure if she had um, any of the the swelling in any of the other toenails. The other toenail looked okay. Okay. They look okay. Okay, Joanna, thank you for allowing us to film it today, okay? Okay. Okay, very good. Thank you very much. Thank you for watching my video. As you can see in this video, COVID-19 caused her nail to become infected, then deformed. It's been very challenging for her to wear shoes, especially sandals, during summer. These COVID-19 toes have been documented in medical journals, but I've never seen in person until now. Boy, it was terrible. Until then, be educated, get empowered, encourage others today.